Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Today in this video guys, I'm going to tell you how to install this FPV camera onto your drone frame and then connect it to the DVR via flight controller and also connect the camera control onto the flight controller using the camera control pin that you have on your flight controller available. As you know guys, the flight controller that I'm using is PDB F7 version 2 guys. It has a dedicated pin for the camera control. So guys, I'm going to use that pin so as to be able to connect this Ant FPV camera onto this this flight controller guys in my previous videos guys I have also told you guys how to connect the DVR onto the flight controller and how to connect the VTX guys so if you have not seen that video guys I will put the link of the video above or in the description below for you guys to check it out so guys if you are new to assembling drone ensure that you watch this video till the end so that you do not miss out on any important information or instructions that I have to share before we move further guys if you are new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notifications for my new videos let's get started so guys, before we start with connecting wires, let me quickly walk you through on how I'm going to connect it and give you a high level overview of the wiring diagram that I'm going to use. So here on my flight controller guys, here I have a camera control pin. This pin is a dedicated pin that comes with this Speedy BF7 flight controller guys, so as to be able to control the menu option which is available on to the camera guys here guys you have a ground and 5 volt that is how I'm going to power the camera and then you have a video input pin guys here on to the DVR guys that is how I'm going to connect the video input and then there is a video output already going out onto the video input pin of the flight controller so this DVR guys will be between the camera and the flight controller so as to be able to record the videos which is being captured by the FPV camera guys. In addition to that guys here you can see it has a longer hole and a smaller hole guys that is where your camera mount is going to be installed it is the same on both the side guys so as to be able to install the camera and screw it up from both the sides so that it stays at its place. This is the Ant FPV camera guys as I have told you before it has a 5 volt ground and video output pin and then you have a ground and OSD pin that is going to be connected onto the flight controller so this OSD will be controlled by the camera control pin from the flight controller guys and then video output of this camera is going to the DVR and then we are going to power this up using 5 volt and ground so that is how we are going to do it let's do it quickly now guys we will solder the positive and negative terminal guys these are the power wires coming out of the camera guys so 5 volt and ground red being the 5 volt and black being the ground let's quickly connect them onto the flight controller so this is the black wire which is the ground I am going to connect it here so you can see guys my ground wire is connected now let's quickly connect the power which is red wire so here you can see guys my power and ground is being connected so as to be able to power my camera so the next one guys is the black wire guys which is coming out of the camera guys this is the OSD pin which is going to be connected onto the camera control so this is the black wire and this is the green wire is the ground so the ground will not be connected to anything guys so I will leave that alone the OSD pin from my camera control is going to go on to the camera control pin of the flight controller so here is my camera control pin guys let's quickly connect that So guys my camera control is connected, my power and ground is connected, now this is the video output from the camera guys that is going to go on to the video input pin of the DVR so let's quickly connect that too. So this completes the connection and the wiring of the camera onto the flight controller and to the DVR guys. Now let's quickly install the camera onto the drone frame. So before we do that guys, as you can see onto the front side guys, it is quite large space here to install this camera. So I will be using the bracket. Uh, this is the bracket or camera holder guys that comes along with this camera guys. So as to be able to install this camera onto the larger frame. So what we have to do first guys is to push this camera into this camera holder like this. So like this. So 
so that the side holes matches with the camera guys let's quickly screw the camera onto this camera holder using the screws that came along with this so from the side just so guys on the one side i have already installed the screw now let's quickly tighten the other side screw guys as well so as to hold the camera to its place so once the mount is ready guys you can install the mount onto the frame using the holes that you have onto the side here you have three holes on each side guys but you would be needing only two one to hold it and one to manage the angle of the rotation of the camera guys so as to align the camera as well so that is what it is used for let's put in the camera before we do that guys let's put in the wire guys onto the back side junction here you have the wire connector guys so let's put the wire connector that we soldered onto the drone frame guys let's first align them together so that they stay together now guys since we have bunched it together let's quickly shrink it together so that they stay together using the shrink wire guys now that guys they are shrink together let's put it from to the bottom and then take it out from this side guys so as to be able to connect the camera so this is your three pin and two pin junction that will go on to the back side of the camera let's quickly connect them too so there is three pin and two pin connector So as you can see guys, my three pin and two pin connectors are now connected. Let's install the camera onto the front. You would be needing two larger side screws guys, so as to hold it at its place. So these are the screws guys that I'm going to use. Let's put it on from the side guys. So here are three holes guys. I'm going to align center one onto the top one and then tighten it up using the screws that we have that is how i'm going to do it so this is the first screw guys let me tighten it up using the screwdriver so first one is tightened up guys from to the side let me do the same from the other side So this is the screw guys that I'm going to put it here and then tighten it up using the screwdriver. So this is the screw guys I'm going to hold the camera like this. As you can see guys my camera is now installed if you want guys you can install another screw onto the side so as to be able to move the camera top and bottom guys as and when required so it's going to stay there by the help of the friction which is generated by this screw and the camera holder guys so this is it guys this is how you install the camera onto the drone frame guys so this concludes this video guys in my future videos guys i will also be telling you how to configure this camera onto the firmware of the flight controller guys so ensure that you stay tuned to my channel so this is it guys this concludes this video i hope you guys like this video if you guys like this video please do not forget to hit that like button if you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below i will try and answer as soon as possible if you are new to my channel and not yet subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button and click that bell notification icon so that you get the notification for my new videos thank you guys thanks for watching and clear skies